get into business to truly fill a need, not a selfish desire. Welcome to another episode of Midweek Motivation with me, your host, Marcus. On today's episode, we're going to talk about why being selfish will lead to failure in being in business and why selfless will help you have more success. Now, this channel is dedicated. I'm going to pivot. In my channels in the past, it's just been about general success, how to have success in your life. But now I want to switch and like this channel is uh, now devoted to helping people that are self-employed become more successful in their business and anybody who wants to be self-employed and also anyone who's just interested in the general topic of success. I've seen success as a self-employed person. I've been self-employed for about four years now and it's uh, I definitely have my ups and downs. I want to share this information with people because I understand how hard life is. Okay, so let's get into the video. I remember get into business to truly to truly fill a need not a selfish desire okay now why is this important okay i want to share something with you that you probably never heard before okay it's this selfishness is self-destruction in slow motion okay i'm gonna say this again it's important for you to hear to be successful selfishness is self-destruction in slow motion okay now why is that why is selfishness self-destruction in slow motion i'll tell you why okay look a lot of businesses fail, a lot of self-employed people fail because of two things. Either they fail because of laziness and a lack of knowledge, okay? When you're selfish, you're more inclined to not give your best. It's all about what you want, okay? When you're self selfish, you're going to work less. When you're selfish, you're going to only think about yourself, okay? To be successful, we have if, if we want to be successful, we've got to forget ourselves. We've got to forget what we want. we got to focus on what the other person wants, what's going to make the other person's life easier, okay? Now, I want you guys to succeed long term, okay? And I'm gonna tell you a secret from somebody who is incredibly successful. I'm gonna tell you a secret from the most successful person I ever met in my life, okay? He said to succeed in business long term. Now, I don't want you just to succeed this month or next month or just next year or the year after that. I want you to be successful 10, 15, 20 years from now. And as if you've been watching my channel for any length of time, you know that success is living the life you want, but specifically success is financial independence and mental health. Okay, that's what I define as success. Okay, mental health is the new rich, as they say. Being at peace with yourself, loving yourself, you know, having joy in your in your heart. That's that's success. Okay. Now if you're gonna succeed long term, this is what he said. You have to add value for your your customers, your employees, your vendors, your suppliers, and your community. Okay, this is Charles Cook. I met him back in like 2016, 17. If you look at my, he's like one of the 10 top 10 richest people in the world. I met him. I hung out with him. Okay, this is real. Okay, he's the most successful person. He is the most successful person I have personally ever met. This is what he said. He said to succeed in business long term, you have to add value for your customers, employees, vendors, suppliers, and your community. Okay, you got to make their lives better. If you're focused on if you're selfish, you only focus on what you want. You're not going to focus on making life better for the people. You're going to focus on making life better for yourself. And that may work in the short term, but I guarantee in the long term, it will not work. Okay. If you honestly, if you make your life solely about you, you will be unhappy. A lot of us are unhappy in life in general because we only think about ourselves, what we want, how things are not the way we want them to be. And it's just an incorrect, it's just not the right way to be happy. Okay. I, I've seen this through experience and I've learned that the less you think about yourself and the, or the more you think about others, the happier you'll be. Okay. The more you think about others, the happier it will be. Okay. You will succeed in self-employment. I've done this. You will succeed in self-employment. If you make the person that you're working for their problem, your problem. Okay. You cannot do that. If you're operating from a selfish mindset. Okay. You'll get stuff done faster. You'll work longer and you'll put more into it. If you're selfless about it. And all selfless means is that you're thinking about the other person's needs and desires above your own. Okay. That's another secret to success and self-employment. If you can put the needs and desires of other people above and before your own, you will be successful. Okay. You'll get clients and you'll get people to stay, okay? But it's got to be more about them. You got to sublimate. You got to forget yourself, right? All right? Because remember, get into business to truly fill a need, not a selfish desire, okay? A lot of people out there are self employed or want to be self employed and don't know. And it takes a lot of time. I've gained this wisdom through lots of reading, books, personal experiences, okay? People, they want to work with selfless people, okay? Now, I'm not, I'm not perfectly selfless, selfless, but I have seen what works at the. The more selfish you are, the faster and better things will get for you. Okay, because we got to act as if the life we want is an emergency and act with a sense of urgency towards where we're trying to go, okay? And we're get into business to truly fulfill a need, not a selfish desire, okay? A lot of people start business because they want to make money. That's the, that's, the, that's the wrong way to do it. The right way to do it is like, how can I help somebody? 
what can I truly do, okay? Now, if you're starting a business in 2021 or you just started, you know, this stuff will help you, okay? But you got to focus on what the other person wants, okay? In closing, selfishness is self-destruction in slow motion, okay? You don't see what you're doing to yourself, but slowly, if you're living a selfish life, you're slowly, you're not going to see the fruits of your labor until 10, 15 years down the road when you made your life completely about yourself, okay? A lot of the errors and sins in our lives comes from being selfish, thinking only about ourselves and hurting other people. And self selfishness is truly harmful, okay? You're not going to be as successful as you could be if you were selfless, okay? Now, if you enjoyed this video, please share it with your friends and family. I post videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday on my respective channels, okay? From now on, it's going to be, like, for example, this this week's video is Midweek Motivation with Marcus White's Success Secrets. Success Secrets for the Self-Employed, okay? There are secrets to success. There are things that people do not truly tell you, like selfishness is self-destruction and slow motion are the two reasons, the, the two big reasons why people fail in business because of laziness and lack of knowledge. As I talked about in the in, previously is that if you're going in truly selflessly you're going to seek all the knowledge you possibly can and you're not going to be lazy you're going to put more time into it because you're really helping somebody okay if you want to truly help somebody face to face and really making a positive impact in somebody's life being self-employed is going to help you okay and being selflessly self-employed is going to help you all right because i do want you guys to win and i've learned that all pretty much all successful people are generous and so I want to be generous with my information towards you because I truly love you, okay? And I want to be kind to you, okay? Being on, and also, being kind just means being friendly, generous, and considerate, okay? Now, how can you be kind to yourself and be kind to other people and add value to other people's lives so that not only can you help solve their problem, but you can get paid for, okay? That's what entrepreneurship is, solving someone's problem and getting paid for, okay? And also, being selfless is about something that's inside of you, as I talked about in my video, in a previous video that it's what's inside of you that determines if you go up like a balloon, okay? See the link to my video. Um, and also click on my picture if you haven't subscribed, okay? Now, um, thank you so much. And please share with your friends and family. And um, as always, successful people that make decisions based on their current situations. Unsuccessful people that make decisions based on their current situation and successful people, something that you're trying to be, make decisions based on where they want to be, okay? Make decisions based on where you want to be. Understand that selfishness is self-destruction in slow motion and that you want to get into business to truly fill it a need and not a selfish desire, okay? Thank you so much. Remember, make the life you want, getting the life you want an emergency, okay? And act with the sense of urgency, okay? Because life is brief, all right? Share this video and help somebody else, okay? Bye.